Good afternoon, it's Nicholas from Gandor Gaming, and today I have some brand new exciting cards revealed from the Bandai Productions. We have some brand new One Piece cards for the brand new six starter decks. Now, we only have the first three, and they're all from each different leaders, but all three of them are cracked out our minds. So let's get straight into this. So first things first, we have the brand new Smoker card. This is uh, the brand new Tashigi. She's a five cost, 6,000. And she is pretty busted. Basically, she has two effects. If your leader is Smoker on play, give a character minus four cost. And then once per turn during a main phase, you can kill a zero cost character, which is absolutely incredible. So this card literally says, hey, in a Smoker deck, you can play this card on your fight on turn, kill an opponent's character with four costs, because you're gonna lower it by five, four costs, and then use its ability to KO a zero cost, and just keep going from there. And if they don't remove this card, this card is just gonna be able to kill zero costs every turn, which is very impressive and very scary for your opponent. Uh, this is a great support card for Smoker in particular, because the card specifies you can only use this card if your leader is Smoker, which is actually a really, really good plus. Because a lot of these generic black cards or other color cards, like, they're cool, but if every leader can just play it, you just play the best leader, and then there's no reason to play like leaders like Garb or Smoker, because why would you play them when you have better leaders? So I like that they're giving these new archetypal cards that are like, you must play this in this leader, you cannot play this in like Rob Lucci or Sakazuki or Gecko Moria, you have to play it in Smoker. Which makes me pretty happy. Uh, now we have a new brand new Whitebeard slash Ace card. This is a new 5 cost Ace Rush card. He only gains Rush if your leader is a Whitebeard Pirates card. So you can play it in both Ace and Whitebeard. Uh, it's a 5 cost 6,000. And it has the ability, if this card will be KO'd by effects, you can minus 2,000 power instead. So basically it has some protection effects that is really, really good against, literally against black. This card is literally saying, oh, your opponent's going to remove this with card effects. Well, now you're protected, so you're all set. Not to mention, in Whitebeard and Ace, this is just a really, really great rush card, especially for Whitebeard. Uh, if the deck's already impressive being a six-life uh, leader, this card literally says, let's put some pressure on them. And nothing says more pressure than a 5k 6,000 vanilla. So, uh, let's keep going. Uh, now we have the brand new Dolphy slash a Boa Hancock card. Uh, this card is a custom card, I'm not gonna lie. It's a new four-cost... 6,000 power, zero counter, Boa Hancock, that has a custom ass effect. First, first things first, it's a four cost 6k, which is already insane. Uh, we already have two others in the form of Gecko Moria and Edward Weevil. Now we have Boa Hancock. Uh, she is a blocker, so she's a 4k 6,000 blocker, and she has the ability on play, look at the top three cards of your deck, put them in any order, then if your leader is seven lords of the sea, give them a rested dawn in blue dolphin in particular this card is cracked not only is it a 4k 6000 blocker that you have to play for free but you get to then put a rested dawn immediately on your leader and stack the top three cards in your deck meaning not only are you now swinging for eight now when you play this card because you're swinging for seven with dolphin's ability then this card is going to be played stack your deck and put a rested dawn onto that said leader so now you are swinging for eight, played a free four cost for free, and stacked your deck. This card is a custom card. And if you don't remove it too, it's a four cost 6k vanilla blocker. That is absolutely incredible. It's what Blue Dolphin needs, and it's what Boa Hancock needed. So I'm really happy, and that's really about it. I hope you all enjoy. I can't wait to see the more reveals we get for not only Blue Dolphin, but also the other starter decks. Like I know of Green Uta, we got confirmed that all the promos that came out for the... Uh, champion six uh sets or the uh tournament packs those will be reprinted in this new structure deck so that's really good if you're excited to get the wind blows or any other promos that came out you can do it will be reprinted which is really solid but don't forget we're also getting new green uta support uh, i think we're gonna get Kai curry support there's so many good cards we're gonna get i can't wait to see where it goes from here so i hope you all enjoy for getting stupid and see you on the next one bye bye